Top of the morning, dolls. Top of the morning. Happy, happy Valentine's Day to all of my beautiful dolls and gents. You are also included. So happy Valentine's Day. Yes, the men do get gifts too. The men are also looking so dolls make sure the husbands get something too um it could be a spa day it could be a um facial or it could be something from us here at seven shades of beauty we do take care of the men too especially the shave bumps the dark areas on the face that's called um post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation or how they shave and then they get these dark lines yes we do take care of the men too and for my LD, LGBTQ community I hope I didn't get it right happy Valentine's Day you are also family you're also a part of seven shades of beauty and you know auntie love you too bits my family happy happy valentine's day um today we're going to talk about uh cleaning and detoxing our bodies you know sometimes we say our creams are not working we're in a stall nothing seems to work does sometimes we just have to give the licensed esthetician a call if you're basically tried everything over the counter and I've said it time without number beauty supply products they work only for a short period of time and I try my best to educate you guys on how to alkaline your body detox your body break the stall and get back on your skin bleaching journey now we've got the trolls that are going to say you hate yourself and you know all that good stuff if you hate yourself then why would you want to adorn yourself if your face is covered in acne and you know it's not looking bright and you walk out with it these trolls are the same person that's gonna say oh my god what's wrong with her face dolls it's your face it's your money as long as you're happy then you're fine throughout my career as a esthetician and as a medical personnel I've never heard of skin bleaching killing anybody Persons die of cancer every day and they never bleach their skin. People die every day and who's complaining? Nobody's going to the, uh, the plastic surgeons that are putting whatever in uh, the bodies of these ladies. Nobody's complaining about the posterior that looks like, you know what, or the upper part of the body that looks like you know what nobody's talking about it because they feel that that is beauty that is eye-catching well sis if skin bleaching lightening and toning works for you by all means do it it's your money your body your business I used to worry about the comments I used to turn them off I stopped I just ignore it because haters are gonna hate and if I didn't make a post and if they didn't see it then they would not be able to make a comment about it yeah so dolls do what makes you happy do what makes you comfortable so if you're struggling with your skin okay you've been bleaching for over 20 years at some point your skin decide that oh, I'm, I'm just stuck I'm in a rut let's get you out of it guys you have to clean your body inside and out you have to um, do your detox yeah this is my detox this is what I drink throughout the day now it is um I've got kale in there I've got some green grapes I've got cucumber and I've got celery I've got some ginger I've got um, green apples and lemon 
and this hydrates my body throughout the day. I'm, to be honest, I'm not big on water because I retain water. So I'm really not big on water. So basically I drink my fruits because I cannot digest certain fruits. So I drink my fruits and I do try to get a bottle of fresh water in because that also helps to flush the kidney. But don't let anybody tell you you have to drink eight glasses of water per day. No, don't overload your kidney and then you start to retain water because it's really not cute, especially when you're not able to wear your nice shoe. And I'm on my feet every day. So yes, I do wear my compression stockings. But dolls, when you get into a stall, there is a reason for that. There's a reason why your products are not working because why would it work for Jane and not for for you it doesn't necessarily mean that um the products are not good but there is something going on it could be you're on a particular medication and it is um neutralizing the efficacy of the product so that's why we do free consultation this does is for those of us that are struggling with those hormonal acne adult acne, um, post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation, where you've had a baby or that's um, months afterwards and then, you know, you start to break out, you scratch it and then you're left with the scars. Or, you know, you, you just went through a move to a different state, different climate, your skin decide to break out. Does we can take care of it also this is what stops the melanin production so over time your melanin is quite powerful you're not going to wake up and it stops in one day all right so stick with the program follow my advice we will uh, come up with a routine that works and also guys your biotin this is good for your hair and your nails and does when you get your serum please use your serum because this is like a coating yeah so you apply this only in the daytime it will help to stop your skin from being dry okay and uh, our serum we now added some avocado oil yes avocado oil and we added some cucumber extract for hydration and exfoliation to your soap and guys this is just a part of my daily routine where 